Happy Friday, everybody. This is a pick a card reading for today, Friday, June 10th. You pick a card, it's your main energy, but I do pull the cards all together. And if you're born June 10th, I'll do your reading next. So if you pick card number one, you have the Five of Swords. Okay, so the Five of Swords. This is a day where pick and choose your battles, okay? Um, because I do feel here you're anxious to either get rid of people um, or there's that kind of energy where you're kind of, I don't want to say, yeah, you're kind of like on the guard. Um, and it could be because of fear, okay? I don't know why you know, there's an underlying cause of fear here. But there's a new path opening up for you. There's a lot of help around you and um, blessings coming in. So I do see that energy too. Just know that. For some of you, if you know something's not good for you, get rid of it because something new is coming in. That could be a group of people, friends, love. There's a new path opening up. So I do like that. Card number two is a major arcana of the Hierophant. So that is a it's a significant day for you. Um, you will, it's like seeking the truth or getting a truthful answer. And I do feel your intuition is going to be important. Okay. Um, the truth, some kind of truth will be revealed and this is your truth as well. And you know, you will know something. Um, I do feel that there is messages, intuition or connecting to, um, it's like, it's your intuition. And then there's like, um, following your intuition, uh, your, your gut manifesting is really strong here there is something very there's a fast moving energy here okay and you're fast to 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 i want to say you're going to be quick you may have to think on your feet but um you'll you'll get the truth or something and something significant may come in and it's um for some of you it's something you manifested too it's very positive so yeah Something very spiritual here. This could be a total awakening and a whole life altering thing for someone out there. Okay, that's why I was like, whoa. <laughs> Card number two. You could be dealing with a group of people. This is like from an institution too, I want to say. But it's positive. Okay. Card number three. You have the five of cups. Expect some sudden change of plans. Um, something just suddenly changes. Maybe you were excited about something and then it's like turned around and you're like negative about it now. There's a lot of hope though. Maybe you wanted to get together with a group of people or something or there was a date or something and something changes. So there could be a change of plans um, and you were hopeful. But um, also, don't listen to any gossip. You may hear something. Maybe you're not happy about it. There is something there. There is a lot of hopeful energy. Do not give up faith and hope is what I'm picking up today, okay? And stay positive. Five, double fives in, include changes of perspective, but also of emotions here. We have the Hierophant and we have the Five of Cups. Um, something may trigger from the past, okay? I do feel that energy. Or we're waiting for something. There is definitely patience that is needed. Something in the next couple of weeks will come to fruition, okay? These are desires or something connected to the past or something is ending, there can be a change of direction with work, career, finances, money. Something is changing. For some of you, I do feel you're coming to the end. This could be money owed to you, maybe coming through as well. I do pick up an Aries energy as well. I do feel love is showing up here as well. These are partnerships and alliances that we're forming as well. I keep saying as well, as well, as well. Well, I don't know. It just comes to me sometimes. Yeah, I talk the way I do. Something will be shed to light, okay? financial independence to be able to um, invest in something that you've been wanting to do before. But I want to say patience. Some of you may have to wait a little longer is the best I can explain here, okay? All right, happy Friday. I hope you have a wonderful Friday. Happy birthday if you're born today, June 10th. This is a quick and general reading. This is your solar your theme and your wish card. Your solar your theme is the Page of Cups. Okay. Excitement, decisions, moving away, relocating, um, making a lot of plans for the future, but keep yourself open. These are strong new emotional beginnings. For some of you, um, I do feel that these are it's something new it's not something maybe it's maybe it's a wish that you never thought you'd wish before 
there is victory and success coming triumphant success i do feel that for some of you this is dealing with child custody battles or a child may be coming through and there will be some victory and success um the universe will have a play in this so you're going to have to go with the flow okay um there is a strong ending coming up okay for some of you, this is also love. You may meet someone who already has like a ready-made family or a child. For others, I do feel talk, counsel, therapy, all of that is coming in. A um, lot of wisdom, change of emotions, more balance this year as well. Things may show up during the solar year where you're going to feel a little stuck and where you're going to feel there's no movement, but you're being held back for a reason. You will have a major, major decision to make, and this could be about moving. You may travel and relocate. I do see some big activity and changes on the home front. There is going to be new people, new experiences, and your home dynamics could be changing this year, okay? Your wish for your solar year is the high priestess this is a major arcana too know that something's coming to an end you're free is um is what i'm feeling in um this wish is coming going to come with a little delay but there's a strong new beginning here it's a yes all right the the important numbers for your solar year nine zero six eleven twenty one two 22 1 i hope you have a wonderful birthday and a blessed solar year ahead and beyond everyone else a wonderful friday and bye for now